What's going on ladies and gentlemen, Dr. D-Dub here, and welcome to Portal 2! Also, hello, we're doing a face cam for this one. Because if we're gonna play a game where you guys are gonna watch me suffer and get frustrated slightly, I figure it might as well have the, the facial expressions to go with it. But, we're not gonna be doing any more Portal, we're gonna go straight into Portal 2. I realized that the, the bonus, like, campaign levels or challenge levels, whatever they were called, well, they were fun for me, and I'm going to continue doing them. I am going to finish that game 100%, I think. They're not that fun to watch. I watched a couple back, and there were some comments saying that it's it's just not as fun without the commentary of a sassy robot every couple seconds. And we're, we're going to get more of that with this game. At least that's the goal. So, let's play some single player. There's also multiplayer as well. Ooh. Okay, so there's... Ten chapters. I'm not going to make the mistake of thinking that... <laughs> you get, you guys know the mistake that was made in Portal 1, or just Portal. Anyway, this game came out in 2011, I believe. So it's still old, but just looking at this... It's so much better than Portal. Just graphically. That's right. You have been in suspension for 50 days. In compliance with state and federal regulations, all testing candidates in the Aperture Science Extended Relaxation Center must be revived periodically for a mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. Okay, you will I guess it's a buzzer. tutorial. When you hear the buzzer, look up at the ceiling. Let me know. You will hear a buzzer. <laughs> when you hear the buzzer, look down at the floor. Let me know if you guys want subtitles in this Good. or not. This completes the gymnastic portion of your mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. Gymnastics? A painting on the wall. Really? Please go stand in front of it. This <laughs> is art. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, stare at the art. Okay, I'm really good at this so far. You should now feel mentally yeah. invigorated. If you suspect <laughs> staring at art has not provided the required intellectual sustenance, reflect briefly on this classical music. I'm gonna love this game. Good. Now, please return to your bed. Okay. <laughs> yeah, the subtitles, they are helpful in seeing what's being said. That's the goal of subtitles. You have been in suspension for but... nine, 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 Whoa. Nine, nine. This Hello? Anyone in there? Subject should vacate the enrichment Hello? immediately. Any test subject. Ah! Ah! Oh, God. You look um... Good. Looking good, actually. Are you okay? Are, are you... <coughs> Don't answer that. I'm absolutely sure you're fine. There's plenty of time for you to recover. Just take it. Please time. prepare for emergency evacuation. Stay calm. Stay, stay calm. Prepare. It's all the same. Prepare. It's all fine. All right? Don't move. I'm going to get us out of here. Oh, you might want to hang on to something. Word of advice. Up to you. What? We're experiencing technical difficulties. What the heck is going on? You all right down there? This is so cool. Most test subjects do experience oh. some uh, cognitive deterioration after a few months in suspension. Now, you've been under for quite a lot longer, and it's not out of the question that you might have a very minor case of serious brain damage. A minor but case of alarmed, serious brain right? damage. Uh, although, if you, do, if you do feel alarmed, try to hold on to that feeling, because that is the proper reaction to being told that you've got brain damage. Do you understand what I'm saying at all? Does any of this make any sense? Just tell me, just say yes. <laughs> this is gonna be so fun. Okay, what you're doing there is jumping. Uh, you just you just jumped, but never mind. Say apple. 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 Okay, you know what, that's close enough. Just hold tight. <laughs> all reactor core safeguards are now non-functional. Please prepare for reactor core meltdown. How do you prepare for a meltdown? Okay, look, Whoa. I wasn't going to mention this to you, but I'm in pretty hot water here. How are you Holy doing, crap. David? You're still holding on. The reserve power ran out, so of course the whole relaxation center stops waking up the bloody test subjects. Whoa. Hold on, this is a bit tricky. And of course, nobody tells me anything. No, why should you tell me anything? Why should I be kept informed? You know, about the life functions of the 10,000 bloody test subjects I'm supposed to be in charge of. <laughs> Why? It's close. Whoa. Can you see? Am I going to make it through? But I've got enough space. Oh, crap. Uh, no. Just, just got to get through here. No, it's not working. I, I just got to concentrate. 
Where and did he go? Do you think it's going to be when the management comes down here and finds 10,000 flipping vegetables? Alright, so now I hear that one. I hear that one. <laughs> this is such a cool sequence. Okay, listen. This is we should get our way story straight, alright? If anyone asks, and no one's going to ask, don't worry, but if anyone asks, tell them as far as you know, the last time you checked, everyone looked pretty much alive. Alright? Not dead. Pretty much alive. Okay. Almost there. On the Docking. other side of that wall is one of the old testing tracks. There's a piece of equipment in there that we're going to need to get out of here. I, I think this is a docking station. Get ready. Are we going to jump? Or are we going to smash through the wall? Good news. That is not a docking station. So there's one mystery solved. Uh, I'm going to attempt <laughs> a manual override on this wall. Could get a bit technical. Hold on. A manual override on the Almost wall. Almost there. Remember, you're looking for a gun that makes holes. Oh, yeah. Not bullet holes. But don't worry, you'll figure it out. Seriously, do hold on this time. This is so fun. Well, there we go. Now, I'll be honest, you are... Whoa. Hello, and again, welcome to the Aperture Science Enrichment Center. We are currently experiencing technical difficulties due to circumstances of potentially apocalyptic significance beyond our control. However, thanks to emergency testing protocols, testing can continue. These pre-recorded messages will provide instructional and motivational support so that science can still be done, even in the event of environmental, social, economic, or structural collapse. The portal will open this and emergency testing will begin in three, two, one. Well, this starts vaguely familiar. You guys remember this from the first game? Oh, and there we are again. Hello, us. How's it going? We don't look that much better than we did last game. This is the same place. Is this not exactly how the first one started? It is. This is cool. And button based testing remains an important tool for science, even in a dire emergency. If cube and button based testing caused this emergency, don't worry. The odds of this happening twice are very slim. <laughs> so, this is the same testing facility, but just, it's gone to hell. This is so cool. Please note the incandescent particle field across the exit. This Aperture Science Material Emancipation Grill will vaporize any unauthorized equipment that passes through it. I think the the uh, the sassiness will return shortly. What was it? I forget his name. The the little robot dude and his, his sass. At least this still works. That scared me. I got startled by a loading screen. <laughs> if you feel liquid running down your neck, relax, lie on your back, and apply immediate pressure to your tablets. You are simply experiencing a rare reaction in which the material emancipation grill may have emancipated the ear tubes inside your head. Oh gosh. Okay, all this stuff seems to... Oh, I take it back. You can say all this stuff appears to be working, but... It is not. Okay, one out of 19. This is familiar, but not. Is this the same thing again, where they just slowly start moving around? Oh, it's telling me to go over here to the button? Okay, now we can go grab this, bring it back out. This is such a cool change in atmosphere. I'm really liking this. Where's the pad for this? Do we need to push a different button to open that one? It is, and we do. Okay, so this is really simple. I think this game's added new mechanics as well. These are just the, the familiar ones. Where's the exit? Here? Okay, yeah, I think there's new... These cameras are all sh shut down and not working either. Good. Makes sense. Because of the technical difficulties we are currently experiencing, your test environment is unsupervised. 
Before re-entering a relaxation vault at the conclusion of testing, please take a moment to write down the results of your test. An Aperture Science Reintegration <laughs> Associate will revive you for an interview when society has been rebuilt. Okay, so this is the whole elevator system between levels, just like the first game. This is gonna be awesome! I can't wait to meet- Oh yeah, Wheatley is his name. Again. He's fun. If the Earth is currently governed by a manner of animal king, sentient cloud, or other Whoa. governing body that either refuses to, or is incapable of listening to reason. They just bow down to the giant animal skinned turret. That's exactly what happened. <laughs> I feel like there's... I need to take a look at the achievements in this game and see if there's any kind of like collectibles I need to be keeping my eye out for. Okay, so it's not the exact hey, same hey, chambers you made it. all over again. There should oh, be hey. a portal device on that podium over there. I can't see it though. There Whoa! Whoa. Can you see the portal gun? Also, are you alive? That's important. Should have asked that first. I'm, do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to work on the assumption that you're still alive. <laughs> I'll still wait for you up ahead. I'll wait, I'll wait one hour, then I'll come back. And assuming I can locate a dead body, I'll bury you. All right? Brilliant. Go team. See you in an hour, hopefully. If you're not dead. This guy is hilarious. And here's our portal gun. I'm assuming it can do both. No, we only have a blue portal. That's fine though. Look at the artwork there. Look at all this artwork. That's kind of cool. The cake. Oh. That's cool. This is Gladys from the first one. That's awesome. All right, I guess we keep going up. This just plays so much more smoothly and it's just, it's beautiful. I'm loving this. Okay. I guess we have an hour to get there. That's plenty of time. You can see your portals through walls. That's new. Can I break through this? No. Some emergency testing may require prolonged interaction with lethal military androids. Rest assured that all lethal military androids have been taught to read and provided with one copy of the laws of Robux to share. Oh gosh. All right, we need to get up there now, which means more portal placing. I love when we get our second portal. I feel so limited Good. just having the if one. If you feel that a lethal military android has not respected your rights as detailed in the laws of robotics, please note it on your self-reporting form. A future Aperture Science Entitlement Associate will initiate the appropriate grievance filing paperwork. Why are all these storage cubes, or not storage cubes, companion cubes, blocking everything? All right, I'm gonna still try to keep these to like 20 minutes. Very dangerous. To help you remain tranquil in the face of almost certain death, smooth jazz will be deployed in three, two, one. <laughs> why? Oh, that's why. Okay. This feels very familiar. Can't pick it up from here, though. Okay, so we'll need to bring this back up. Actually, we'll need to do this first. Oh, that is conveniently placed. Cool. And there's still no sprints in this game. Control is crouched, though. All right. I'm gonna have so much fun with this game. It's still very... It's so quiet. Actually, I'm gonna get up there first. 
think. Yeah. Okay, there's the one. And where's the second one? Is it down here? It's got to be down here, right? Yeah. Cool. That was easy. Great work. Because this Thanks. message is pre-recorded, any observations related to your performance are speculation on our part. Please disregard any undeserved compliments. Really? That's funny. Whoa! That's cool. Being able to see these through walls is disorienting. Like, I feel like I can go through that, but I obviously can't. Alright, we're gonna explore a little. This feels like a very explory area. So we're not gonna go that way. We're gonna go up. Let's see what's up here. A whole lot of nothing is what's up here. Ah, there is something though. Unreason. I don't... That's all just equations. And a cat! Jumping over the moon. That's cute. And another cat. And another, and another, and another. And another. That's a companion cube made into a cat. That is awesome. Alright. Let's keep moving. <laughs> hey, an elevator that functions like it should. I wonder if this place will get any less... Like, bust it up as we keep going. Like, I don't know if as we go deeper, is it going to get the more? the center is currently being bombarded with fireballs, meteorites, or other objects from space, please avoid unsheltered testing areas wherever a lack of shelter from space debris does not appear to be a deliberate part of the test. <laughs> I don't know if it's going to get more or less damaged as we continue here, but... Okay, so the metal stuff we can't place the portal on. Nor can we place one on the floors or the walls. But we can right here. Ooh. This just looks awesome. Like, I'm loving this. Okay, so there's a portal on the wall. So if we shoot out of it, which we can't do. There's a companion cube. Can we go there? Welcome to the first level that is going to puzzle me. A puzzle that is puzzling. It's almost like it was meant to be. <laughs> okay, if I go around here, does this lead to anything? Just the cube. Okay, so if I just stand on this first. Oh no, this is the button. I'm dumb. There's a lot of that that'll happen, I'm sure. Cool. I did not mean to set that up. But it totally worked that's new that's awesome hold on can we we can but that one's there hold on that probably needs to go there because it's going to drop something else That didn't work. What does this do? Ah! That's what I should have done first. Cool, so I get to like... Whoa! If it works, it works! <laughs> that was awesome. Okay, cool. Well oh, I the I've missed this game. Center remind you that although circumstances may appear bleak, you are not alone. All aperture science personality constructs will remain functional in apocalyptic low power environments of as few as 1.1 volts. Cool. All right, I'm thinking we have time for like one more level, or maybe not. We'll see. We'll see. All right. Let's see how difficult this is. We this may or may not the attempt this. Of momentum to movement through portals. If the laws of physics no longer apply in the future, God help you. Okay, this shouldn't be too bad. Let's do this. So this is, involves. I don't, I'm not even looking where we need to go yet, but it's always kind of the same. So we'll do that. But we need a cube first, which we get from from where. From here? Whoa. 
That's kind of cool. Okay, so then we need to jump through it again with it. Let's do it. Cool. That was simple. If you are a non-employee who has discovered this facility amid the ruins of civilization, welcome. And remember, testing is the future. And the future starts with you. All right. I thought that was the end of that room. It is definitely not. All right. We've got a cube there. Where's our portal already? There's always a portal. At least for the time being, there is. Can we make that? No, we can't. Okay. Portal's down there, so I need to place the, the ones that I'm jumping to. Okay. Whee! All right, and I need to get where now with this? Do I need to smash that? Or just go around the corner? Probably that. Uh, let's do it all the way up there. Will that launch me there? Let's find out. Here we go. Oh, it totally will. That hurts. Can I go around here? I can. Sweet. Does that do what I needed to do? Ah, now we do it again. And that's our exit. Doing this with two Good people. Work getting this far, future starter. That said, if you are simple-minded, old, or irradiated in such a way that the future should not start with you, please return to your primitive tribe and send back someone better qualified for testing. These pre-recorded messages are great. All right. I'm gonna head to the next one just to see if that promotes us. Or not promotes us. Progresses us to the next chapter. To ensure that sufficient power remains for core testing protocols, all safety devices have been disabled. The Enrichment Center respects your right to have questions or concerns about this policy. Cool. All right, that's where we're going to end it for today. I'm going to try and keep these shorter than I did with Portal. I didn't do the best job of keeping those to 20 minutes. So I'm going to try to do that a little bit better in this series. But I hope you guys are excited for another mini-series Monday. The Garden Paws thing was just kind of a... It wasn't planned, it just kind of happened. This is planned, though, so we're going to have some fun with this. I don't know how long I'll keep this going for, though. You guys will have to let me know what you think of the series, whether or not you want the face cam or not, whether or not you want the subtitles or not. Right now, everything's been pretty easy to understand, so they're not super necessary. But, but that's going to do it for this one. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time. Until then, though, as always, take care. <laughs>